the all new Gorilla Glass hybrid glass panels. This is a development that we've been working on with Corning, together with Corning for the last year. We'll be launching it first on the 4 GT, but we think that it's uh, applicable for all of our uh, future vehicles. This is absolutely uh, first in the industry. It's the newest thing that's happened to glass since 1923. Henry Ford actually brought laminated glass to North America in 1923. We're probably most familiar with the application of Gorilla Glass to cell phones where they needed very thin screens. It's a much stronger, uh, more resistant to damage glass that we're, that we're doing. When it was a standard piece of soda lime, soda lime, and it was subjected to the, the rock or the, uh, the snowball, the ice ball, uh, the glass uh, bent and broke when you took that and replaced it with a lighter weight, thinner uh, piece of Gorilla Glass, it was able to survive that. It was able to absorb that impact without, without breaking. It's a significant weight reduction in the glass, the vehicle glass. It's actually a 30% re reduction in uh, glass weight. Lightweighting is, is a huge trend in the auto industry right now. There's no part of the car really that automakers are not going to try to figure out how to lose weight. The lighter the weight, the better the fuel economy, the better the performance, the better the handling and the braking, the faster the, the, faster the braking, the, more, the, the smoother, the faster the acceleration. Weight is the enemy. But they also need to do it safely and they also need to do it with delivering as much performance as possible and improving the vehicle experience overall. We can go thinner, we can go stronger, we can go lighter.